With iOS 8 and Yosemite comes a new feature called Handoff. Handoff allows you to start doing something on one Apple device and easily continue it on another. Before you can use that though, you'll need to set it up. On your Mac, just open up System Preferences, and then head into the Bluetooth setting and make sure you have that enabled. Then, make sure you're connected to Wi-Fi. Finally, head back to the General setting and make sure the Allow Handoff Between Your Mac and iOS Devices box is checked. Now then, you'll also need to do a couple settings on your iOS device. Head into settings and make sure you have Bluetooth on and you're connected to the same Wi-Fi network as your Mac is. Then head into general handoff and suggested apps and make sure handoff is turned on. Now you're all set to actually use handoff to exchange information between devices. For example, if you're browsing a site on Safari for iOS, you can send that over to your Mac. When Safari is open on iOS, you'll see a new icon on your Mac's dock. Click on that to open it, and you'll see the site you were just browsing on your iOS device. It works the other way as well. Let's say you start an email and mail and want to finish it on your iOS device. Just start the email, and you'll see a new icon on your iOS device's lock screen. Swipe up, and you're taken directly over to the mail app to finish it up. You can also answer calls on your Mac. When you get an incoming call on your iPhone, you'll see a notification on your Mac. Click the notification to accept it, or click on the drop-down menu for more options. If you accept the call, you can start talking right there on your Mac. Right now, it's just a handful of Apple apps that are using this feature, but we'll certainly see more as third-party developers add it to theirs. As always, for more, go to lifehacker.com.